Dear students, here in this video we are going to know projections of plane surfaces. The problem is like this. Uh, the top view of square lamina of side 30 mm is a rectangle of sides 30 mm into 20 mm with the longer side of rectangle being parallel to both HP and VP. Draw the top and front views of the square lamina. What is the inclination of the surface of the lamina with HP and VP? Okay, see first, uh, first we find out the all the details of the first and second and third portions. Okay, see here uh, we need to identify the two details. One is a plane of projection, another one is uh, how does it resting on that plane. Okay, see uh, for first portion, okay, in this problem, plane of projection is not given directly. See here directly not given it is on HP or VP it is not given directly plane of projection is not given directly by knowing the details of second position we can find out the plane of projection for first portion okay first we identify the details of the second portion okay here not given directly either HP or VP after that we should know the what are the details given for second portion here see uh, the top view of a square lamina of side 30 mm is a rectangle okay of side okay top view of the, that is a shape of the top view is given for second portion the top view is a rectangle okay the top view of a square lamina the given name of the lamina is square the top view of square lamina is a rectangle that is second portion okay now see already uh, I discussed with this table. See, in these three, any one is given in the problem. Theta, check it is given or not. If theta is not given, you check it this one. Yeah. Above distance is given. If theta is not given, above distance is not given, then you have to check it. Shape of the top is given. If shape of the top is given, First position is on HP. If shape of the top is given, first position. Here shape of the top is given. Then the first position is on HP. Okay now. If shape of the front is given. If shape of the front is given. See here. Shape of the front is given. The first position is on VP. Okay. See like this we identify the plane of projection for first position. Now we know that if shape of the top is given then the plane of projection is HP. If shape of the front view is given the plane of projection is VP. Now how do you know that resting out edge or corner here next I will continue. Longer side of rectangle being parallel longer side side means resting on edge or side. Okay these are the details given for first portion and this is the second portion and third portion longer side of rectangle being parallel to both HP and VP longer side of the rectangle this is for third portion okay for first portion hp is there for hp we have to draw the top view first if it is vp draw the front view above the x y line okay it is on hp is there draw the top view as a square resting on side below the x y line top view draw the below the x y line front view draw the above the x y line since it is on hp is there draw the top view below the x y line resting on side a b okay this is the top view construct a square of length 30 okay draw the vertical line this is 90 degree and this is also 90 see like this you construct the square with the help of this uh, you uh, draw the front view okay project all the points of the top view towards uh, upward uh, up to xy line okay by joining these two we will get the front view on the xy line by observing here what are the points are visible b and c are visible b dash c dash a coincide with b within bracket a dash d d coincide with c within bracket d dash this is the first portion these are the first portion of uh, uh, first set of uh, uh, front and top views okay let's come to the second portion see what is given second portion shape of the top is given here okay for second portion what is given theta is not given this above distance is not given what is given shape of the top is given when shape of the top is given we need to find out theta is how much okay huh. first we need to draw the top view okay we need to find draw the top view 
टॉप यू शेप इज रेक्टेंगल टॉप यू शेप इज रेक्टेंगल सी वे यू इनक्लाइन दि सर्फेस दिस ओरिजेंटल लेंथ विल बी रेड्यूज ओरिजेंटल लेंथ विल बी रेड्यूज वेन इट इज इनक्लाइन ओके सी नाउ जस्ट विथ द हेल्प ऑफ दिस टॉप यू ड्रा दि रेक्टेंगल सेकेंड टॉप यू दट इज सेकेंड टॉप यू प्रोजेक्टेड ओके Thirty. This length is thirty, and this length is that is one thirty into twenty. Horizontal length will be reduced when it is inclined. Twenty. Then thirty. Then this is twenty. Okay, this is the rectangle of side thirty into twenty. Okay, this length is how much? This length is twenty. This length is twenty. And this length is thirty. Okay. Now project. Okay. Give name the all the vertices as A, B, C, D. Now project all the points up to x y line. Project it. Project it. Okay. Ah. See here, which is resting here. There are two points are the which is resting. That is on x y line. Which is resting here. In front view, B dash A dash is resting. Mark it. This point is resting here. This edge is resting in the top view. Okay, B dash A dash. This is the resting that we have to mark it on the x y line. Now, C dash D dash. How much it is inclined? Okay. Now we will get the okay. How much it is inclined? See, project this point upward. Simply you project it. Now measure the distance of front view. First front view measure how much is the distance. Okay now, see measure how much is the distance of this. Now with the help of this, you cut this. Okay. Now you will get this point on this vertical line. This point is C dash bracket D dash. Okay. Join these two points. This is the front view. This is the front view. Now you measure how much is the angle. This this angle is the theta. This angle is the theta. Okay. For third portion, longer side of the rectangle being parallel. Okay. Longer side here. These two are longer side, and these A, D, and B, C are shorter sides. Okay. Longer side. Any one you consider A, B, or C D any one you consider make parallel to H P and V P that is nothing but make parallel to X Y line okay see redraw this what is the condition A B is parallel to X Y line A B is parallel to X Y line okay you draw anywhere below the X Y line okay any convenient distance okay next after What is that? See how to rotate. I rotate like this. This is a A, B, C, and D. Okay, A, B, C, and D. Okay. Without changing any dimension, I will redraw here. But the condition is longer side parallel to X Y line. That is the parallel to both X P and V P. Okay. Now you project all the points. Okay. A vertical line, A horizontal line. This point is A dash. B vertical line and B horizontal line. This point is B dash. C vertical line and C horizontal line. C horizontal line. This point is C dash and D vertical line and D horizontal line. This point is D dash. Just you join A dash B dash C dash. This is the front view. It is required final front view. This is the final front view or third portion of the. This is the third set of view. These two are the third set of views.
okay na okay now i want see what to be find out here what is the inclination of the surface of the diamond with the hp this is the which hp how much is the theta measuring that is hp now i want to find out with respect to vp okay if you want to find out inclination first we have to draw the side view with the help of side view we can find out theta and phi okay hmm. first i will draw the one vertical line perpendicular to thin vertical line perpendicular to x1 and this line is called as x1 and y1 x1 y1 line okay at the intersection of x1 and y1 at the point is this here i measuring the 45 degree line draw the one 45 degree with the help of this mark the 45 degree okay draw the 45 Okay, draw forty-five degree line here. Draw forty-five degree. This is forty-five degree from this x line. Okay, see uh, when the projections of the top view and front view are intersecting, we will obtain the front view. Uh, we will obtain the side view. When the projections of the top view and the front view are intersecting, we will obtain the required. Uh, side view okay first i will project all the points of the top view okay see these are the project up to x, this line then i will project upward to meet the project to meet the projectors of the front see here on this line c and d two points are there on this line then from the front view here c and d on this horizontal line then these two projectors are meeting This point is okay. Uh, I will give you the name later. Okay. Next after the from this point. Okay. What are the points are there? A and B on same or up to this 45 degree line. Then you see A and B. Then this is the projector line from front um, top view. Then you project upward to meet the points of the front view. A and B on this horizon. Okay. This point. Okay. When you are observing, since it is side view, side views are designated by small letter with double dash. Okay, when you are observing, B dash, C dash are visible. A coincides with B and D coincides with C. Okay, this point. Okay, this point is nothing but B double dash bracket A double dash, and this point is C double dash bracket D double dash. By joining these two points, we will obtain the required side view. Okay. by measuring we know that this is the theta and measuring we know that this angle is phi this angle is phi or you can also know the draw vertical line this angle is phi okay by measuring theta is 48 degree and phi will be 42 degree okay thank you